Happy Tuesday, everyone. Look at that beautiful clear sky from Palo Escrito. Looking at Soledad, where earlier we could clearly see the lights. Now we can clearly see the river squiggling through the Salinas Valley. Nice and full, not too full. It's really been at a healthy level for much of this winter as we've seen some clear days, some rainy days, and we've just been stuck in this pattern. Really nice variety. Today, one of the sunnier days and warmer days, but look at this from uh, Embassy Suites Monterey Bay. You can see just a very thin, shallow layer of the marine layer right there. Just some fog over the Monterey area. That's only going to be for another couple of hours, and then we'll see lots of sunshine. 45 degrees right now in Monterey, mostly 40s across the region, some low 40s in our valleys, some 50s near the coast, 52 for Big Sur, 49 for San Jose to San Francisco, so still a little chill up there as well. And then for today, it is going to warm up nicely. So you may want to grab some layers for the morning, but by the afternoon, near 70 for most of the region. Now some upper 60s near the coast, some upper 70s for our inland communities. And then tonight, really doesn't get dark until about 8 o'clock. And so hopefully you can enjoy some of that sunshine after work or maybe on your lunch break because it's going to be quite pleasant today. 25 up at Lake Tahoe to start, so some cold air still present. 60 by this afternoon, though. 70s to 80s for much of the state. 88 Palm Springs, locally 65 today. That's about 5 degrees warmer than yesterday. Then tomorrow will be another 5 degrees warmer. Look at all those 80s in the Central Valley, 94 down in Palm Springs, 81 Los Angeles. So warming continues for everyone, but only for a couple of days. These are your forecast highs for our inland communities, mainly for the valleys, maybe even some mountain communities getting into the 80s tomorrow. Now our bodies aren't used to 80s as much as we've had nice little warm ups and cool downs. We haven't seen 80s for quite some time. So if you have a strenuous job or if you have uh, any sort of workout, if your kids play sports on Wednesdays, it is going to get hotter than we're used to, especially inland. So keep that in mind. Take breaks and make sure to stay cool. I know 80s don't seem that hot, but when we're not used to it, it is. Then it cools down for the weekend. That's when we also have rain coming simultaneously. I've jumped up to Friday. That's when we're tracking this system to get closer to the coast. As of right now, it does not look like we're going to see rain on Friday. That could hold off till Friday night or even Saturday morning. But look at this. It does look like that's going to bring us some rainfall, some significant rainfall, perhaps a couple of inches. Nothing too impressive, but still looks like a rainy weekend all the way through Sunday. So Saturday, Sunday, your rainy days. Until then, gradual warming, 60s to 70s for today, 70s to 80s tomorrow, maybe some upper 60s right on the coastline. And then you can see that chance of rain uh, for the weekend.